Back during the Internet's golden era, there was multiple YouTube shows on the Internet. These shows were called, web series. They consisted of various animated shorts formed into a show on YouTube. One of these shows was one that actually got qualified as an actual series that was more than just a web series. That show just as so happened to be, Happy Tree Friends. Happy Tree Friends is a show disguised as a kid's cartoon, the show follows the misadventures of few anthropomorphic forest animals, whose initially peaceful lives always end with sudden, usually accidental, graphically violent ways, like Kenny from South Park. Happy Tree Friends became insanely popular worldwide and even got its own fan base where people tend to make their own OCs based on various Happy Tree Friends characters. However the fan base had its moments. The big giveaway was the toxic users that were slowly overtaking the fan base and bullying regular users off the platform. One instance that happened was a devastating one and nearly everyone on that fan base left out of pure horror because of one particular fan episode made by a mentally unwell user that committed suicide out of depression after he uploaded the video. On the fan base, multiple users would make their own HDF fan episodes. They always depicted of their OC shipping each other with other HDF characters. Other animations were made just for fun, only to get popular later on. This fan episode was nowhere like the others. One fact about this video was that it was one of those ship videos that being flippy x flaky. The intention of this video was to say his final goodbye to the HDF community before his death. The animation became lost for several years before it was found, saved on the deceased user's computer by his now 23-year-old brother. He would re-upload the video on the Internet Archive for everyone to see. The following is a complete summary made by the brother describing what the episode featured. The episode starts off with the usual intro for the show. The title card read, Flip in Flakes, in the usual font. The episode was starring Flippy and Flaky as it's a Flippy x Flaky fan episode. Something was off about both of them though. Flippy's colors were washed out and he looked slightly unhappy. Flaky was a bit transparent, other than that she looked normal. Since this was one of those multi-part episodes, it had another section in the intro where it shows who the other characters were gonna be, which were, Toothy, Cuddles, Giggles, Nutty, Lumpy, Handy. The actual episode opens up and we see the usual purple forest-like area, or whatever you call it. It then pans over to the playground where Cuddles, Toothy and Giggles are at. They play for a few moments before Toothy stops and starts talking to Cuddles in the usual gibberish. He and Cuddles run off laughing while Giggles stays behind on the swing set. We then see the two run off to the neighborhood with what appeared to be a drone-like device. They turn it on, and it activates and flies to the left direction while Cuddles watches in amusement. It then cuts to show Flippy walking down the sidewalk in his normal state. He walks past Flaky who was sitting on a bench. Flaky stares at him and seems to, how do I put this? Get attracted, to him. She decides to walk behind him while acting as if she's trying not to scare him. It then cuts back to Cuddles and Toothy, who are now trying to pull a prank on Flippy by attaching a water balloon to the underside of the drone. They activate again, and it moves left again, although this time it was moving much slower, probably because of the weight of the water balloon. The water balloon was now heading towards Flippy, and this is where the odd shit happens. The screen for some reason started glitching, the closer the drone got to Flippy. Flaky notices this and tries to get him to look at the drone. The drone drops the water balloon on Flippy, and water gets all over him. The music suddenly stops, and we just get dead silence. After a few moments, it then cuts to show possibly Flippy's POV. It shows a warlike area with multiple dry landscapes with loud explosion sounds and gunfire in the distance. Flippy looks down at his body, and sees that the water made it look like blood was all over him. He looks up and sees a helicopter above him cosplaying as the drone. Flippy then flips out and turns into Flippy, first P backwards or replaced with a Q. Flippy then grabs, fuck, I mean grabs the drone, and walks over to Cuddles and Toothy. The drone is somehow still on, and lunges at them still holding the drone. The usual screams and blood and stuff are heard from them. We just see Flaky staring in horror. It then cuts to show Cuddles and Toothy's corpses. 
It seemed like Flippy killed them using the drone, as there were multiple cuts all over their bodies. They also had the drone's broken remains stabbed through their heads as well. It then cuts to show Flippy staring down at them before he comes down and returns to normal. He then realizes he caused this, judging by the blood on his hands, and runs away clutching his head. Flaky tries to run after him, but trips over the corpses. The next scene shows the gas station. We see Giggles walking in with a sad expression. She goes up to Lumpy who was sitting at the cash register, watching something on a portable TV. Giggles tries to get Lumpy's attention, but it cuts to see what Lumpy was looking at. It was a news report of Cuddles and Toothy's corpses seen on the road. Giggles sees the TV, and gains a frightened expression before her eyes well up with tears. Nutty then walks in, making those usual noises and is shaking like crazy. Giggles doesn't notice and continues to cry. Nutty sloppily takes a bag full of jelly beans and runs over to the cash register, knocking Giggles over in the process. Lumpy doesn't notice him either, and Nutty tries slamming the jelly beans on the table to get his attention, period. The bag breaks and jelly beans spill all over the floor. Nutty screams and frantically tries to put the jelly beans back into the bag. Flippy walks in and sees the jelly beans on the floor, and it cuts to another POV shot of him in the same war field from earlier. This time the jelly beans seem to portray grenades on the floor, and Flippy flips out once again. The scene cuts to black right there. People actually assume that the video was finished, but that's not the end of the story. A few people saw that there was a part 2 and 3 of the episode, and now everyone saw the last two parts. The second part starts right after part 1. Flippy flips out and lunges towards Nutty and slams his head on the counter, breaking his head open. He goes after Giggles next and punches her in the face so hard that she flies toward the wall. She screams frantically for help as Flippy slowly walks towards her, but she looks to her left and her pupils go tiny. It cuts to show what she's looking at, and it's Nutty's smashed open head on the floor. Flippy then does something that made me almost shit my pants. He rushes off screen and comes back holding a large bagger-like object. He runs towards Giggles again and proceeds to stab her in the vagina, twisting it like crazy along with a black box covering her private area. I had a feeling the black box was there to prevent the video from being age-restricted. Giggles' screams here are unlike anything heard in HDF. It sounded like a woman shrieking so hard that it almost sounded like her vocal cords were about to burst. Flippy stops twisting and starts laughing like crazy before fading out of the gas station. It then cuts to show the gas station again, this time on fire. Flames were coming from various holes in the building. It then cuts to show the inside of the burning building. We see Giggles lying dead on the ground with the dagger still in her vagina, the black box still there. The entire place is trashed with snacks and drinks and even the cash register torn apart and on the ground. Loud coughing noises are heard in the background, meaning that someone was still alive. It cuts to the left corner of the store where we see Lumpy. He had char and burn marks all over his body and one of his antlers was broken off. He was seemingly looking for something until he picks something up. It was the TV. He runs out of the store, sits near a tree, and continues watching the news. Suddenly, a loud explosion and a flash overtakes the screen, meaning that the gas station exploded, killing Lumpy. It then cuts to show Flaky walking down the forest area, slouched over with a sad expression. She stops and looks to her left. The camera cuts to where she's looking at, and it's a faraway crater in the floor, possibly the gas station. Flaky looks back to where she's looking at and continues walking. It cuts to the same forest from that one campfire episode except brighter in color. Bird and jungle noises are heard in the background. Flaky is then seen walking from behind a large bush, still slouched over. This time her eyes were red, almost bloodshot, and she now looked tired. The screen glitches yet again, albeit much worse, and Flaky has now stopped walking and is now staring at the ground. Suddenly, we hear what sounds like Handy screaming in the background, accompanied with flash door splattering sounds. Flaky immediately becomes alarmed, and slowly moves toward the screen where it cuts to where she is going to. A small clearing. Multiple transparent images overlay the screen, depicting Flippy holding Handy's tail in a bloody heap, still in his flip state, no pun intended. 
She lays on the ground, gets into a fetal position, puts her head in her knees. After a few seconds, loud rustling noises are heard, and Flippy emerges from the trees holding Handy's severed head. Flippy goes back to normal again and sees Flaky. Flaky notices Flippy and sees Handy's head on the ground. Flippy just stares at Flaky with a look of shock. Flaky then gains an angered expression and breathes heavily before shouting various gibberish at Flippy. We then see Flippy's face and he rapidly shifts from his normal state to his flip state in a very fast manner. The screen goes to black and part 2 ends. Part 3 starts with a black screen before it shows Flaky being thrown at a tree. Flaky shuffles back, shaking and starts pleading like crazy. Flippy is standing over Flaky, and he has an even more psychotic look on his face than what he usually gains. His eyes were now melty looking and had blur effects added to them. His mouth was not only wider, but his teeth were cracked along with drooling blood as well. Flippy, instead of laughing, lets out a blood-curdling scream that had the same energy as when Giggles had the dagger stabbed in her vagina in the previous part. The screen glitches the third time and goes black, and for split-second intervals, we see Flippy not only mutilating her, but also biting and eating parts of her flesh as well. After the screaming and blood gore sounds stop, we see a one second long clip of a guy holding a camera in his hand not being seen, dropping a hedgehog off a cliff into a stream of water. After another long black screen, we now see the outside of Flippy's house before cutting inside. Flippy has bags under his eyes and seems to be getting ready for bed. After he brushes his teeth, he is seen getting into bed before going to sleep. It then cuts to show Flippy in the same forest like before, except it looked trippy. There were swirly colors everywhere and there was a heavily edited flanger-like ambience playing in the background. Flippy looks around and calls out making a hello noise, but nothing reacts. We then see Flippy going over to the playground and stops. It cuts to see what he's looking at, and it's a shadow in the shape of Toothy. Flippy moves closer and reels back in horror, making a shocked expression. The camera cuts to what he's looking at, and what I saw almost made me shit my fucking pants. Toothy was standing in front of the screen. His body was covered in dirty soot. His eyes looked as if they exploded all over his face along with parts of his sclera left behind. His mouth was stretched so wide that it extended across his whole face along with his buck teeth being missing. Dark blood was streaming down his face as well. Lastly, he was slightly shaking and twitching as if having a small seizure. That wasn't over yet as he was also really slowly gliding towards the screen as well. Flippy runs away from Toothy in full panic mode while panting heavily. He comes to a stop at another part of the forest. He looks around frantically and a loud snapping noise is heard. It cuts to where it is coming from, and it's from behind a nearby tree. A pink long arm suddenly comes from the side of the tree, and plants to the ground with a thumping noise. Giggle's head suddenly emerges from the side like her arm, and her face is mutilated just like Toothy's. Her bow is missing along with her bulk teeth, and she has no eyes, instead replaced with another mouth, and like Toothy, her mouth was also stretched open in a wide smile. It cuts back to Flippy now breathing heavily, and looks all around him. Multiple other HDF characters featured in the episode around him having multiple different mutilated features. Lumpy's head was replaced with the TV as well as depicting static. Flippy was now breathing heavily, and he clutches his head screaming no over and over again while screaming and crying. It then cuts to a grayscale flashback sequence, which showed various real HDF episodes of Flippy killing the other characters, starting with the first episode where he gets introduced to now. At the last slide where Flippy kills Flaky, white text can be seen all over the screen saying, It's all my fault. I can't control myself. It then cuts to show Flippy lying on his side, covered in injuries and gashes. Tears are streaming down his face, and he is whimpering softly. It cuts to show one last flashback image, which was a stock Flippy x Flaky photo where they hug and nuzzle each other as sad music plays in the background. It cuts to the next scene where Flippy suddenly screams, waking up in his home. I assume this to be a nightmare. Flippy then stares down at his hands, and they are covered in blood again, but there wasn't any blood earlier, so this had to be a hallucination. 
Flippy begins to cry, and puts his hands over his face. It stays like this for 15 seconds with somber music playing before fading to black. The final scene in the episode starts. It showed Flippy standing at the edge of a cliff with a veteran's stare on his face. The screen glitches one last time with Flippy still standing on the cliff. Flippy then jumps off the cliff immediately without hesitating. It shows Flippy falling down the cliff and Flippy's faint laughter can be heard as this is happening. After 25 seconds of Flippy falling, the screen cuts to black, and a sickening crunch is heard. It cuts back to Flippy, now on the ground with his neck violently twisted to the left of his body and his eyes having no pupils. There is complete and utter silence as it shows this. After 15 seconds of his dead body being on screen, the end credits of the show suddenly come out of nowhere with normal music and all as if nothing had happened. Text showed up at the end of the credits, accompanied with a faint image of the user's profile picture. The text read the following before the video finally ended. Life is cruel, you know that.